Hi friends, today we will learn uh, some important aspects of logic. Uh, we have discussed logic means study. So in today's class, important words starting with logic, ending with logic. And uh, you know, if you understand the basics of this uh, Greek literature, Greek origin, what we call etymology, means origin of words, study of words is known as etymology. Then definitely I promise Egyptology, it may be dermatology, it may be diabology, it may be dosiology, it may be economics, it may be ecology, whatever those words are ending with logic, you can understand. So you just see, we have beautiful words for today's discussion starting with dendrology. What is dendrology actually? You just see, there are so many logic, you just logic, 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 right? All these logic you will find. Then, you just see, this dendro means tree. Dendro means, dendro means tree. So, dendrology means, dendro plus logy means, study of trees. Right? This demonology means, study of human beings and their behavior. So, demon, that is human beings. Sometimes we call this demon as also people also population so whenever this demonology is concerned that means study of those human behavior right another word demo means also demo means people demo means people population human being so demonology means study of human behavior human uh, activities all this dermatology next one dermatology dermatology means study of skin Actually, this dorm means, dorm means skin, right? Are you getting my point? Dorm means skin. So, dermatologist means, dermatologist means skin doctor, skin doctor, okay. So, dermatology means study of skin. Next one, diabiology. You see, diabolism means actually study of devils. This uh, diabolism means study of devils. Alright, study of devils, all these things. Dosiology means, this dosiology means study of doses. Suppose you are taking medicine. Alright, so you need more doses, more, uh, you know, power. So this is known as dosiology. Ecology. Ecology means study of environment, right? Next, economics, study of uh, wealth, study of, uh, you know, uh, you know, you may say uh, economy is known as economics. Edaphology, actually edaphology means study of soil. Soil, their behavior, soil, their uh, characteristics, their properties, fertility, all these things are known as edaphology, all right. Now you see, Egyptology, Egyptology, Egyptology means Egypt is a country in the northern part of Africa. So study of Egypt is known as Egyptology. Next one, Electrology, Electrology means study of electrons, electricity. What is electricity actually? Flow of electrons. So flow of electrons is known as Electricity and this electrology means study of electricity. Emetology. What is this emetology means? Actually, emeto means omitting. Means uh, something you have uh, 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 eaten and uh, out of uh, food poison you have uh, some problems in stomach. So that is known as emetology. Next one. Diplomatology. Diplomatology. Diplomats, you know, ambassadors, high commissions of different countries. And if you study about the diplomats, it's known as diplomatology. Are you getting my point? Entomology. Entomology means study of those insects. All the small, small things is known as entomology, right? You just see enzymology. What is this enzymology actually? Enzymology means study of enzymes. is known as enzymology, right? Next, epidemics. Epidemics. Epidemics means spreading of diseases. Spreading of, uh, you know, uh, uh, 
great uh, uh, like your plague, like your uh, cholera, all these things. Next one, pathology. Pathology, you know, uh, study of diseases, a place uh, where you study something about those uh, diseases or diseases that is known as pathology. We sometimes call uh, uh, laboratory, means uh, uh, the place where scientists and doctors, they research about those diseases, like for AIDS, uh, you may say, cholera, you may say, all the measles, all the diseases is known as pathology. Next one, cytology. What is the cytology actually? Cytology means study of tissues. Alright? Study of tissues, cells, all these are known as cytology. Okay? You people have enjoyed this class and I hope you will definitely enhance your vocabulary if you follow this logic. Thank you very much.